Welcome to Zern. In this video, we'll show you how you and your students can sign into your Zern school account. There are four main ways you and your students might sign into Zern Clever, Classlink, Google, or a Zern username and password. If you aren't sure which you should use, please contact your administrator or email us at support at zern.org. Let's start with Clever. Signing into Clever will be similar for teachers, students, and administrators. First, navigate to your school or district's Clever portal. If you're on the Zern homepage, you can get there by clicking Sign in with Clever. This will take you to your Clever sign-in page where you'll be asked to select your school information from a drop-down. You will then be asked to sign in using your Clever credentials or Clever badge. Once you've signed into the Clever portal, simply click on the Zern icon to be taken directly to Zern. If you're signing into a teacher account on your Zern homepage, you should see a green school account badge in the upper right corner. If your students are logging into Zern via Clever for the first time, students will be given an opportunity to merge an existing non-Clever Zern account that they might have used prior to getting a school account. First, students will be asked if they've used Zern in the past. If they've previously used Zern, they should click Yes, then enter their existing Zern account credentials, which will import their data into their new school account. This allows them to see all the badges they've already earned and will enable you to see their existing progress in certain reports. Note that students only have one opportunity to merge their account, so it's important to communicate the steps in advance. Once students have merged their accounts, they should only sign in using Clever from now on. Like Clever, the process for ClassLink is similar for teachers, students, and administrators. First, sign in to your school or district's ClassLink Launchpad. If you're on the Zern homepage, you can get there by clicking Sign in with ClassLink. Sign into the ClassLink Launchpad with your ClassLink credentials or Quick Card. Once inside the Launchpad, you'll see the Zern icon. Simply click the Zern icon and it will automatically sign you into your Zern account. Like Clever, students will be prompted to enter their existing account credentials if they've used CERN in the past, which will merge their old data into their new school account. Some districts will use Google to sign in to CERN. From the CERN homepage, click Sign in with Google. If you're already signed into Google, simply select your username. Otherwise, enter your district Google username and password and you'll be signed in to CERN. If your students use Google to sign in, they will need to enter your class code, which you will find on the right in your Roster tab, just above your roster. Students will be prompted to enter this code when they first log in, and doing so will add them to your class roster. If your district doesn't use Clever, ClassLink, or Google, you will sign in with a Zern username and password. If you are a teacher or administrator, you should have received an email from support at zern.org with a link to set up your password. Your username will most likely be your district email. If you haven't set up your password yet, or if you've forgotten it, you can click Forgot My Password from the Zern homepage to get an email with a link to reset your password. Once you've created or reset your password, you can sign in to Zern. Students will have usernames and passwords created for them, which you can find by going to the Roster tab and clicking Get Login Cards. These printable cards show each student the username and password they will use to sign in from the Zern homepage. Similar to signing in with Google, if your students sign in with a Zern username and password, they will need to enter your class code in order to be added to your roster. Those are the main ways you and your students might sign in to Zern. As a final note, if you have an administrator account, you will be asked to set up two-factor authentication after your first sign-in, since you have access to exportable student data. If you have any issues setting that up, please visit the Zern Help Center or email us at support at zern.org. All right, you're ready to sign in and get started with Zern. To learn more, join our hashtag MathFam by connecting with Zern on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook for ongoing ideas and inspiration from fellow teachers.